Hello everyone, welcome back to Nuffity and today I'm going to show you how to install Sodium for Minecraft 1.19.3. So what Sodium does is actually gives you more FPS in Minecraft and does a bunch of other stuff. So as you can see right now, I'm actually on the page for Sodium and you can see right here that it gives you a lot more FPS and stuff like that. And down here as well, you can see all the performance that it does give you as well, which does help out your Minecraft. So yeah, I'm going to show you how to install this. Very easy to do. So what we do need is actually Sodium itself. So a link in the description down below to download this. And also, you do need the uh, fabric loader as well, or the fabric just here. So you need to download this as well. So I'm going to download that one. Let that download it in the corner there. And also, back over to Sodium, click on Files just here. And then once you click on Files, then really the newest one just here, the top one, should be fine. So I'm going to click on Download just over here. and let that download. So as you see, it's now downloaded that one as well. So I'm going to knock these two to my desktop just here, just like that. And now we do not need these anymore, so I'm going to get rid of those. Now, the first thing we're going to want to do is actually install the fabric just here. So double click onto the fabric just here. So click on that. And then it should bring a little menu up just like this one. And what you're going to want to make sure that you actually got a 1.19.3 selected in here. So you can select other versions as well, but Minecraft 1.19.3 is the one we want. So I'm going to click on that. And also make sure the install file location is actually to your dot minecraft just there if it's not click on the three little dots just there and locate your dot minecraft folder then once you have done that you're going to want to click on install just here then once you've clicked install it should all install perfectly just like this one and yeah you should get this little pop-up just here like this and click on ok now what we're going to want to do is actually get rid of this file you do not need that no more so i'm going to get rid of that one and now we've actually got the sodium just here so if you don't see the coffee mug in here you might need to right click on the file and click on open with then open with java now if you do not see java here that is because you probably haven't got it installed so i will leave a link in the description down below or where you can install java you need that to actually make this work now if java doesn't work for some reason i will leave a link in the description down below to jar fix as well to actually fix your java so yeah, make sure you do download those and install those. Now very soon I might have a video on how to install Java and Jarfix, just in case you don't know how to do that. So stick around, subscribe to the channel, and that might be coming out very soon. Now that's how we know we've actually got Java installed. Once you've got that little coffee mug in there, just like that, that is what you need. So now what we're going to do is actually go over to your mods folder. Now to get to your mods folder, it's very easy. Go over to your Minecraft launcher. Here's my Minecraft launcher just here. Double click on that and then your Minecraft launcher should load up just like this and automatically your fabric loader should come up in here just like this. And if it doesn't come in there, I will show you how to get it in there. So what you want to do is click on installations just up here, then come down and you should find it just in here. Now, if you can't find it in here, you're going to want to click on modded to make sure the modded is selected just there and it should be in here. And if it's not still, click on new installation. And then in here, you should be able to find it from in here. So for me, it is just there, as you can see. So you click on that, you can name it whatever you want, and then click on Create. That's if you do not have it already down here. Now to install Sodium, what you're going to want to do is click on Installations just here. Then click on the little File button just over here. It doesn't matter which one you do it on. Just click on the little File button just there. And then it should load up your Minecraft directory, just like this one. And right here is your Mods folder. Now if you do not have a Mods folder, just like I don't now, I do not have a Mods folder now because I just deleted it. So if you don't have a mods folder, all you've got to do is right click, click on new, and click on new folder. And then just simply type in mods, just like that. And now you've got a mods folder. And now you can actually place in your sodium mod, just put it in there just like that. And now you've actually got sodium installed. Now if I went a bit faster than that, I'm sorry, you can re-watch the video and you can understand how that works. Now once you've actually installed your sodium, like we just did to our mods folder, now click on play just now. And then you probably get this warning just here. Just click on I understand the risks and click on play. Now as you can see my Minecraft has loaded up and in the corner just down here it does say the fabric modded is actually installed just down here. That is how you know you've actually got fabric installed correctly and everything should just come up down here in the corner. So I'm actually in a world right now and it's actually click on F3 and now my FPS should be boosted just a little bit with sodium. Now it won't do too much on my computer because I've actually got quite a powerful computer and I don't really need to install this but you can install this for loads of other things as well. It doesn't have to be just for boosted FPS. Now if you want to know how to get x-ray in Minecraft I recommend checking out this video here on screen. This is how to get x-ray in Minecraft for Minecraft 1.19.3. So that is it for this video and I'll see you guys all next time. Peace out.